What's up? I'm Troubleshoot. In this super quick guide, I'll show you how to fix this issue, which you could be getting in Rust, where it basically just says startup error is Steam open, even though Steam is very much obviously open in the exact same image. Yeah, pretty annoying. If you're not able to start Rust, this guide should help you. Unfortunately, this issue seems to happen mostly at random based on sometimes how quickly you start up the game after closing it. If you're starting it right as soon as the cloud is still sinking or just after it's finished, you may be getting this error more often than not. Wait a few seconds before restarting Rust, even if you're in a hurry to try and prevent this issue at all. If you run across it, however, close your game completely, wait a few seconds and try to launch it again. Sometimes a relaunch is more than enough. Otherwise, if you've had Steam open for a week or so and you just haven't rebooted your PC, check to see if there's an update for Steam. Click Steam in the top left, followed by check for Steam client updates. You'll see a pop-up at the bottom. Simply choose download and wait for it to finish. Then apply and restart. Once Steam updates and you sign back in, you should be able to launch up Rust once more. And this time, hopefully things work a bit better. If you're still struggling, obviously try and verify your game files to make sure nothing's going wrong, like the Steam DLL being corrupted for some reason or another. Right-click Rust, choose properties, and then on the installed files tab on the far left, choose verify integrity of game files here. If that doesn't work and you're still getting the issue, click Steam in the top left, followed by settings, and on the interface tab over here, make sure that you're not currently in a Steam beta next to client beta participation. Click the drop down and choose no beta chosen here. Once Steam restarts and updates, switching away from Steam beta, you should have a more stable experience for the most part, and hopefully this issue is fixed. That's really it. These are the simplest steps to fixing this issue. More often than not, it's just about restarting the game, if not restarting your PC if this issue really doesn't go away. That's it. Besides possibly checking out if your antivirus might be overreaching and doing something with the game in Steam, there's really not much else that you can do for the most part. So that's really that. Do let me know down below if this video helped you. And of course, if you come across any alternate solutions. Thank you for watching. My name's been Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.